Let's see, in the old Xenoblade, some enemies were immune to break or topple. Yeah. Though in this case, it was, uh... They weren't immune to break or topple. Uh, we're inside. I totally forgot about that. So we couldn't use our level 4 ability. That's the first time I've actually seen that expressed in any kind of, like, substantive manner. And it actually confused the heck out of me. Anyways, so we've got Merc missions aplenty to accept and deal with. But, for now, I'm gonna just buy drinks. At some point, I want to upgrade Boreas, and I think I need drinks for it. I could be wrong. We also got to work on the development of this place. It'll take time, though. I guess I could just buy all of my uh, cores here. Well, let's buy whatever food we can. Because that helps. And it's cheap. Is... The Kenai field skill hard to get around? Am I just really unlucky? It's hard to get. Most field skills are hard to get to begin with. Um, but I think Kenai and stuff... I think I've got one or two. I really should start using these pouch items. Oh, that's... That's the wrong one. Uh, let's see, and we've already bought all of these. To wander, capture a Snorlax. Yes. Well, I guess let's go talk to Hamlish. Got any interesting info? Ah, it's you! Apparently, the Garfond mercenaries have grown in scale again. Perhaps we're starting to properly, how to say, get into our groove? Still, plenty of menial work to be done, though. If you take a look at new jobs, if you don't believe me. Alright, so we get more missions. Now let's go send some people out. Uh, let's see, some Merc group. What do we got? Plenty, probably. Any of the pink ones that I can do. The pink ones are the best. So shipping laden safety. Uh, let's see. So they want a bit ball, two bit balls. Well, I will send out the. Uh... Okay, those are two bit balls, and then strength above twenty. So him, her, her. See, we've got Vale. I guess we'll send Electra along. Frontier Falcons. Is her hat supposed to be like a bonnet? Or is it a, like a witch's hat? Because from the illustration, it always looks like a witch's hat. But I think in game, it looks more like a bonnet. Which sucks, because bonnets aren't, th aren't that cool. But witch's hats are real cool. Okay, so shipping lane safety uh, is a request. Two more... No, no, no. That's the one we just did. Oh, left area. No pond cooking. Okay, so we need one animal and a couple of humanoids. Right, rock actually counts as that for reasons. Right, there we go. Witch hats are cool. Hell yeah, witch hats are cool. Let's see, are they sending this team off to the Besaid Aurochs? No! The Besaid or Aurochs are crappy. You don't, you don't send a, a team of, like, actually good-looking people off to the Besaid Aurochs. No. You send off the garbage people. Oh, interesting. I can only send out uh, two, two squads at once. I was thinking I'd be able to send out three. Okay. Uh, so now that we're done with this, the other thing that... We got a bunch of things I need to do that I should do. Uh, I still want to make it to Indol so I can make some money. Or not money. Um, Cloudway... Fonset Island. Let's hold off on this for a second. We're gonna go do uh we're gonna go do Tiger Tiger. I've been promising Tiger Tiger for a while. We need to do Tiger Tiger for a lot of reasons. Um and uh where things got weird. Let's go cooking. Let's see, I can at the very least make a tricolor bowl. I don't know if any of these are that useful, but I figure I might as well make them anyway. They might come in handy. Anyway, let's go play some Tiger Tiger. Oh, no. First, first we continue to chop away at uh, Tora's house. Someday we'll just be the Tiger Tiger console and nothing else. Okay, so we've got two levels on Tiger Tiger that I can do if I want to. So I have stage one, two, or three. Well, we've done one to death, so let's do stage two. So, turtles can be... Oh. 
That might cause problems. Okay, there's something lurking in there. Okay. I think we'll be fine. Yeah, you can tur you can kill turtles from below, which is super helpful. Especially for coming back up. Of course, we're still probably going to be in a huge amount of trouble. Just because I have not cleared out this level particularly well at all. But, who knows. Okay. There's two. Unfortunately, I'm almost out of air. Which does not make, uh, make me confident for the return trip. Then again, I did kind of remove most of the enemy. Yeah. I did remove a lot of the enemies from the, uh, from the way up. Okay, so I'm just gonna take the ultra safe, ultra not touch anything route. There's like no enemies along one path. I'm not even... Balls. I bumped it from the side. Ah. Well, let's try that again. I thought I was past it. Alright. I can do stage two. I just gotta do it right. Again. Crystals can be gotten whenever. Treasure chests can only be gotten... Uh... Once. And the treasures are kind of what we need the most of. Let's just avoid taking damage. If at all possible. Okay, got that. Got the chest. Okay, have not taken much damage yet. That's a good sign. Got that. Got the fishes. I really wish you could actually stack multiple of those, um... Damn it. Unfortunately, like, it's almost impossible to, like, aim and escape from those things. Okay, let's... We can get this. It just... Uh, those red guys are annoying. I was trying to go for the turtle first, uh, but he was he was like hanging out near the rocks. Uh. Is there? Yeah, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna give this one. We're not gonna be able to now with that like immediate damage. Okay. I can do this. The levels, if they do change, they don't change much. I don't think they change at all, honestly. This is, at least from what I've seen, they've never changed. Yeah, that's the other thing I can do. I can attack diagonally. I've just never been particularly successful at it. It's awkward. If this is a twin-stick shooter, I think... That'd be a lot easier. But it ain't. Okay, so we've already gotten the turtle. Oh, note the levels do change. Today I learn. Okay. Because there wasn't a red fish last time. Okay, and now we're safe. One, two, and yeah, you can stunlock those guys. So let's let's n not get the uh, chest until the end, because that immediately triggers going up. I think? No. I have no idea. Yeah, the levels the levels do change, because we didn't see any of those like weird lurker squid things on the way down. At least we kind of have a confirmation on that, which is helpful. 
All right, now oh, I wanted the last of those. All right, whatever, we're done. We're out of here, and... Hey, I think I had a, I think I had a thing that required a, a score of 20,000. To give me what I wanted. All right, so what kind of treasure did we get? Stage two. Oh, stage, so there are five stages total. Bar, bar, bar. Okay, so we got Hunter's Chemistry, Into the Ground, AC Arts, Boost 1, AB Flank Force 3, and Telepathy 1. And some other stuff. Okay, and that gets her Emergency Mode 3. I'm just gonna go straight up to Stage 3 on this one. It's better to get the side crystals on the way down and the center ones on the way up. Uh, I'm more interested in just securing the treasure chest and surviving. Because if, if I can get rid of all the critters, this gets a lot easier. Speaking of critters, Jesus. Okay, you're new. Whatever the hell this is. It's an aggressor fish. Apparently. Oh. Well, I don't know if I'm getting that on the way back. Okay, well, I'm invincible for a second. That's helpful. Yeah, I just want to get whatever treasure chest I can. Okay, so you can strike through those. Oh, shoot. Ah! Okay, so don't get hit by the bobbly tentacles of doom or the crab thing. Oh, it killed me. All right, well, we get a little bit. Uh Okay, this is hard. This would probably be a lot easier if I could like use a mouse or something. Oh, that's stage one. Can I can I go back? Probably shouldn't sabotage it, but this is not the this is not the one I wanted to do. Okay, so let's try again. Tiger Tiger. Stage three. Yeah, if I really wanted to be crazy and committed here, I could actually, like, go through this entire Tiger Tiger. Uh, I'd have to go through the first couple levels first, unfortunately. Uh, because you actually cannot, uh, You actually cannot do... Uh, Tiger Tiger levels are, are plot-based. Which kind of sucks, but whatever. Okay, there we go. Kind of scary. Oh. And I've got to be worry worried about those guys, because they're kind of impossible spot. Okay, got it. Get the next fixer canister. Okay, got that. Not too wounded yet. I'm like halfway, but I've specifically gotten rid of most of the enemies. Oh, good. We get an air canister. Okay. So, bad news is... I'm gonna take some damage there. Good news is, as long as I keep to the center, we're fine. I think there's, like, one tight spot with the turtle. But we should be able to make it out of here. Uh, this game makes my eyes hurt. There we go. Got it. Okay. Oh, did I miss two treasure chests? I must have. Oh. I thought I got them all. Uh. Alright, well, whatever. We get treasure chests, which is super helpful. Oh, I got them all, but I got hit. That would do it. I was wondering. 
Okay, so let's take a look at these two. Yeah, we drop it if we get hit. I had forgotten about that part. Okay, so these are just trust on Poppy, yeah? Yeah. So I gotta get 50,000. And then trade items at the exchange, which is actually a lot easier. So we probably have to finish that. So... Poppy's favorite pouch items, instruments category. So we probably want to just start chucking some, uh... Instruments. Oh! In Taurus House, Gormot, view the heart-to-heart, -heart, Poppy's remodel. Good to know. So, blade art. So, art and music. Okay. Well, we can create and crystallize parts, or we can poppy swap. Well... <sighs> Skill ramp. So, she has more. I need more ether crystals. Wait. 15,000? Why? How? What the... Ugh. Ugh. Damn it. <sighs> That's some damage. Sucks. Yeah, getting hurt uh, to get treasure is kind of pointless. If we're lucky, we can get we can get another air canister here. I will admit, not feeling terribly lucky at any point in this game. Uh, I missed, and we're dead. Damn it! Times like this, I miss Game Shark. I do too. Like it doesn't seem like I get a whole lot of ether either. I'm gonna start a new Let's Play. Let's play Tiger Tiger 50 episodes. I don't wanna. This game is hell. Damn it. Like, if I got upgrades or something that would make it easier to boot, I think I'd be okay. But this is like, uh... So I never, I never grew up with arcade games, period. So, like, this sort of thing is just awful for me. I, like, the most arcadey thing I, I'd ever played was Commander Keen. Which is to say, not very. I don't... I don't know, just never got into them. I mean, I'm getting better at it, but... There's just so many... So many issues. Okay, we want to stay away from the, uh... The stabby crab. They're just jerks. Okay, I didn't take damage there. Oh, that was that was from failing the shot. I wonder if it does get easier, because it does actually feel like uh, repeated runs get easier. And I'm not entirely sure why. Okay, there we go. Safety. So we want to keep to the right. And we can't cross over. Or take damage. Or go up for any of the ether. Oh, oh, oh! I thought I was I thought I was trapped. All right, we got it perfect. I mean, obviously we didn't get everything, but still, no damage. And also treasure. 
How did I get more... points that other time? I'm very confused. Yeah, I should have been damaged there. Wait, what are the, um... What are the... What are the, uh... Okay, one second. So there's four medallions that you can get up top. Uh... And if you get them correctly, you get, like, a bonus. Let me see. Okay, how to get all the medals? After completing uh, Tiger Tiger, you can gain special rewards. No damage, all crystals obtained, all treasure chests picked up. And fourth medal is gained if you achieved all of those simultaneously. What? I... Ah... Uh, Gah... Ha... How? It's crazy how much the fourth medal increases your score. I'm sure, but like, getting all four? How? I... Because I can just get one special enhancing ram. Do I get one of these? Okay. Okay, so the first one's a bit cheaper. Um, well, I can afford this. What does this do? So these are... Okay. So do I already have one of these on regular Poppy, then? Yes, I do. But we do not have a second arts card. But not enough energy. Backstab damage... Power of the next driver art. I'm curious what the cards do. Well, we should probably go back to the QT because I've put nothing into her. So draw enemies, aggro from enemies, boost starts from auto attack, movement heal. Okay, so I'm just gonna kind of mess with what I can cram in here. Uh. Okay. Uh, level 1's definitely the easiest to do it on, and you'll get about 1,500 each time, if you recall. Okay, yeah, that's worthwhile. I'll take a look at that in a second. Uh, let's see. Telepathy. Interdasting. Opening art. Unfortunately, none of these part types are particularly good. Sucks a bit here. Okay, so... That's just energy consumption. So, flank force, damage from the side. I mean, really, we just want frontal force, which is already on Poppy A. Anger? I guess I'll just do anger for the time being. Oh, it looks like Poppy... Um, Poppy QT actually has a much higher ether crystal uh, space. Okay, so we're going to try... I'm just going to go do uh, the first stage a couple of times. Because it doesn't look like we really get that much extra ether. From it.
Yeah, I've already, I've already screwed it up. Yeah, killing all the enemies and getting all the uh, crystals is going to be very difficult. We do not have to get all of the gears. Which is quite helpful, and luckily... Yeah. I'll just treat this as practice. I'm not even getting all the treasure. It's just very hard to, like, time it. You really have to just, like, gun for it. Which just feels nuts. Okay, let's get up here. And go around. Okay. So I'll just see if I can get the other one. Oh. Well, I didn't necessarily take damage there. And I didn't even get the treasure chest. Bleh. Yeah, so I see it being possible just very hard. Yeah, you pretty much have to... You can't go backwards fast enough. I think maybe that's part of the reason why I run into troubles. Well... I mean, at least we do get a whole bunch of bonus ether from just opening these. Uh, let's see. Yeah, movement heal is kind of useful. So it looks like the higher tier ones get me the uh, the better stuff, but the first one is probably easier to get ether and whatnot on. Okay. Damn it, my kill all creatures thing. If I could attack while ascending, it'd be okay. Or, wait, no, no. Is it kill all creatures? Or is it take no damage, get all ether crystals? I feel like, uh, I feel like I, I'm doing this wrong. There's three. There's take no damage. There's collect all treasures. Oh, I don't have to kill everything. That's just a holdover. I mean, it's helpful. Yeah, you don't have to kill all creatures. Sorry, some part of my brain just instantly assumed that you had to kill every creature. I'm a dumbass. I just bumped into the bottom. Okay. Well, maybe I can get every crystal. Nope. I screwed that up. Yeah. This is gonna be hard. So, crystals, chests, and don't take damage. I mean, thing is, I'm still getting ether from this. What I might just do is just grind this, uh, off-camera. Because now that I'm looking at it, it does actually look like I could get 15,000 ether without too much trouble. Uh, it's just, uh, that initial assumption was just like, oh, that, yeah, that's not doable. Let's see, can you tell Wander how to get the final form? Isn't the final form, um, of Poppy just a chapter 8 thing? Okay. Damn it. Missed the treasure, too. Uh. Yeah, this is gonna take some practice. Before I'm, like, really good at it. It looks like I have to do the line share of the work. Uh. The line share of the work on the way down. And if I don't, obviously we run into trouble. Perfect accuracy also looks kind of like a must. Uh, 
Okay. Well, we'll see. Oh. Okay, so I want to hang out on the left side. I left some crystals behind here. I don't entirely remember how far back. Oh, gonna take damage from that. Well, I'll take damage from that at the very least. Oh, but we lost a treasure for doing so. Well, who knows? I got... I think I got every crystal at the very least, but I did lose a treasure chest. Yeah, so we got every crystal. Which does give me a fairly sizable ether bonus, however, the rest of them are going to be kind of rough. Okay. So it's going to take some effort. Movement heal 3. It does look like we're actually getting a fair bit of good mods from this. Okay. So, mastery is being gained. And half the time it actually seems better to come back up for it. Like, underneath things. Okay. I'll have to avoid jellyfishes. More avidly. Because I'm not killing them particularly well. Okay. It's four there, which actually, now that I'm thinking about it, might be impossible. Yeah, the problem is, if you get off, uh, off sync, you might be in trouble. Ah, and I bumped into, into it in my haste. Well, it's okay. Nope! Screwed that up. <laughs> Missed one. Well, that's okay. Ah! Missed another. But we still have every treasure chest. Which, ultimately, we're still trying to mostly get the, the mods. For... For her. Okay. Well, we got a higher score than last time. And we got every treasure chest. But we took damage. Uh, let's see. We'll do a couple more. I just want to get it once, I think. Because if I can get it once, then be good. Is using the D-pad or the stick? I'm using the stick. I don't... I don't like using the D-pad that much. If I was using the, uh, the regular controllers, uh... I might be okay, but I'm using the Pro Controller. Damn it. Took damage again. Okay. Best two out of three. Well, two out of four? I guess? I'll take it. Oh! I bumped a thing. Damn it. Be neat if those air canisters counted. Uh-oh. No turtle murder. But yeah, we lost a treasure chest. Oh. Nope. For a second I thought the, uh, the little graboid hand would be able to, uh... Would be able to grab crystals for me, because that actually could make it better. Oh, right. Can't attack. Going up. I really wish I could. Would make some things a lot easier. Okay. So, yeah. I'm getting better at it. It's just a couple of careless mistakes and movement problems, and it, uh, it screws me over. It does feel so much faster going up, but I guess that movement speed really does make a difference. Oh, so yeah, those two hit two hits obviously screwed me over. But Let's 
You couldn't stand doing this on a stick. It's so imprecise. I can see that. I just... I don't know. Wow. Did not get much out of that at all. I wonder if I could actually, uh, scrap the, uh, the mods that we've gotten for Poppy. Probably not. Yeah, my problem is half the time I just kind of bounce off of a, uh, off of a corner. Because I'm used to having a much smaller, uh, I'm used to having a much smaller, uh, hitbox. Okay, you can convert mods to Ether Crystal by pressing Y on the screen. That lets you buy them. Good to know, thank you. I'm used to, I'm used to playing some games like this that have... Fairly snappy controls, uh, and very small hitboxes. Wait, that's a shark, not a... Not a turtle. Okay, we're missing one. But yeah, sometimes in my haste, I'm gonna take damage here. It's not great. It's going to make it a lot harder on me. Coming back up. Well. Uh, we'll see. Ah. Uh, yeah, this will be something. Uh, this will be my last run, I think. I will. I will practice and master this off camera. So I more or less have to hang out on this side. Oh. Ha! Come on. One off. It just doesn't feel fair because we can't slow down further. I almost got it. <sighs> but yeah, I'm gonna have to stop. This is actually really hurting my hands. And I don't like it that much. It does really increase your score though. And we did get some good stuff. So, I think this will be fine for now. I'll come back to it later. Oh, boy. Okay. Well, Poppy. Actually, it's this one. Crystallized parts. It's Y. Oh, okay. So, I can crystallize... Tank mod. Oh. Is there... So, are these... Wait, can I not... Oh, it's too expensive. So these increase st stuff like stats and sets the role to healer. I see, so... Roll CPU. We have a tank mod 3. I... That's interesting. Okay, well, we could also do evasion tank. I don't know what the difference is, necessarily. An element core, fire is probably fine. Arts cards. So we do have backup attack, that's not really that helpful. Increases accuracy, sure. And aggro draw, sure. I might look into making some better arts cards. Oh. That's probably where I get topple. Maybe. Either that or a skill upgrade. Okay, so let's let's go back to crystallize for a bit. Okay, don't have any of those back. 
But I do have a bunch of these that I can crystallize. So all the spare parts that I've been picking up are actually worth a fair amount. Uh, I'm just going to get rid of everything. Frontal force is really good. We need that. Humanoid... Slayer is mostly useless. Back force is completely useless. So this is how we get the uh, the more expensive stuff-ish. Reduces spike damage taken by 60%. That's probably not that useful. Don't care too much about that. Increases affinity by 14 when a fellow driver misses an attack. Might be interesting. Don't know. Uh, I'll hold on to aggro boost just in case. That actually is kind of useful. Movement heal turns out to be kind of bad. But this is how we get all of our ether crystals. Let's see, into the ground. Damage dealt to toppled enemies. Yeah, not that helpful. Because evasion while moving, almost never uses. I don't even know what telepathy does. But it's not that great. Damage dealt by 150? No. And that's how we end up with a whole bunch of extra RAM. So let's, let's go to regular Poppy. Because this is much cheaper. I want to see what this does. Okay, so this is just the aggro boost and stuff. So I'm going to go create crystallized parts. Is it arts cards? One of these... Yeah, draw aggro from enemies in battle. One of these lets Poppy break or topple. But I don't know which one's... Which one it is. Oh, I need a technical manual to make half of these, too. That's rough. Yeah, so I guess we're just more or less going to have to keep going as we are. I guess I'm going to get uh, two aggro draws. Yeah, attack team heal would be amazing, but... I need a technical manual. I don't even know where to get those. Let's see. We don't want flank force. Frontal force. But we already have two frontal forces. Let's see. 12% of... Yeah. I'll get those. Humanoid Slayer. The frontal forces are really useful. Because that's extra damage. Oh, topple. No, that's just increases damage dealt. Tor should already be able to topple. Okay, I've never seen him do it. The move is big boost on his drill shield. Alright, uh, maybe I just haven't properly equipped it? 